These are the top 10 secret facts about Tyler Hines. And this one will reveal how this handsome hunk made it to Hallmark. Tyler Hines has been a Hallmark Channel staple since 2018. And with more than 10 films to his credit with the network, he is surely set for a long run of leaving a lasting impression on his fans. He made his debut on Hallmark as a businessman named Zach in the movie Falling For You. There are at least a hundred other guys in this town. One of ask them. The radio station needs the Bake Off and the Bake Off needs you. This town is special. That's part of Pleasant Valley's magic. However, Hines' career in front of the camera started decades before this. Do you know when he started his acting career? Let's get into that a little later. Meanwhile, his first big screen appearance with Little Men was in 1998. Thereafter, Hines went on to find success as a TV actor with roles on Amazon, Valmont, Saving Hope, Unreal, and Letter Kenny. Well, over the years, the Canadian actor has somehow managed to find his way back to the Hallmark Channel. His first holiday movie with the network was It's Christmas Eve, and since then, he's never looked back. He never expected it. And now, a sneak peek at It's Christmas Eve. That's nice. Hines' most recent release, Always at More, which came out in autumn around April this year on Hallmark Movies and Mysteries channel, takes off as his 12th leading role with the network. The movie is about honoring the service industry and highlighting the beauty of Italian art. Talking about his movie, the star wrote on his Instagram feed, to everyone in the hospitality industry who's done their best to keep their doors open these past few years, successfully or not, this one's for you. He went on to write, when your doors are open, we'll be there. Ciao, Bella. The actor also clarified in one of his interviews that he had hurt himself while shooting for more than one scene. I've had some spills in my time. This one really rocked my noodle and I was out of it. I was by myself, just head in my hand, blood in my hands, he recalled, and I was so concussed and very much out of it. Hines added that he was a bit confused and dizzy when he went back to shooting for the last few scenes. Well, one cannot expect any less from a seasoned actor like Hines, don't you think? So coming back to this stud's beginnings, the Canadian actor actually began his acting career at the very young age of eight. He was part of a three-day run of Christmas Carol at his hometown. Hines got his professional start at the age of 8 with his first feature film, Little Man. He also played Atreyu in the TV series The Chosen One and Peter Benchley's Amazon. He was also in Disney's The Other Me and terrorized by teens. This led to a musical performance starring in Cross Canada Tours Rock Opera, where he played 10-year-old Tommy. Much before bagging his big roles for the Hallmark Channel, Hines had already made a mark for himself, but this next secret about the handsome star will make you fall in love with him all over again. Did you know that Tyler Hines is a doting dad? Now wait, before your imagination starts running wild, let's get this straight. We're talking about his pet dog. The simplest way we can put this is Tyler Hines loves his pets. His favorite puppy is a Pomeranian named Rusty James, which is a staple on his social media pages that are filled with his pictures and videos. Can you notice his dog in the picture? Well, it's right beside him. Heinz number one pup, a Pomeranian named Rusty James. He loves to post several pictures of Rusty James who has two more dogs, and he dressed them all up for Christmas. But this little pup is not the only one. Heinz has two more dogs whom he adores with all of his heart, and whom he also dresses up for Christmas and other occasions. According to Heinz, having pets is something that he's always wanted for a very long time, and his family has always been into adopting dogs. He said that after a lot of planning, he finally decided to go ahead, and today he believes that it was the right thing to do at the right time. While there's no doubt that dogs can be your friends for life, did you know that Tyler Hines is best friends with another Hallmark star? Working in the same network has its perks more than you can ever think, and Tyler Hines seems to have found the best ones. People mostly gossip about actors having a competitive spirit with each other, but to our surprise, Hines shares a beautiful bond of a friendship with another Hallmark star. Do you want to know who it is? It's the leading man from the movie My Secret Valentine, fellow Canadian actor Andrew Walker. It might it might not come as a surprise that both of the actors have been friends for many, many years and are often found popping up on each other's Instagram accounts. Best friends with Hallmark star Andrew Walker. Hallmark leading man Tyler Hines and Andrew Walker are not only best friends, but they're also cousins-in-law. Hitterer Mysteries is married to Hines' cousin Cassandra Troy. Tyler and Andrew's friendship took center stage. But there is more to their friendship than just this. Did you know that they're also related? Yes. These two stars are actually cousins, not in the the direct sense, 
but nevertheless. Andrew Walker is married to Hines' cousin, Cassandra Troy, so that makes them cousins-in-law. Coming back to their friendship, the two studs surprised the public when they started to play small cameos in each other's movies. Like, take for example the movie where Hines plays a waiter in My Christmas Family Tree, which stars Walker as Chris. Meanwhile, Walker is featured as a restaurant patron in An Unexpected Christmas where Hines portrayed Jamie, a man afraid to tell his parents that he was no longer dating Emily, played by Bethany Joylens. It was always us, at Aaron Krakow, Walker wrote on his social media page referencing to his partner in crime, Hines, and their other Hallmark Channel bestie, Aaron Krakow, just sitting here enjoying hashtag the 27 hour day with Tyler Hines, my one and only viewing partner at the Hallmark Channel. Take a look at some of the fans' reactions to this brewing bromance. While the love Tyler Hines has for his co-star and friend, Andrew Walker, knows no bounds, here's something else that Hines truly adores, his motorcycle. Not many of you may know that Hines is an avid motorcycle rider. He can often be seen cruising around his black Harley Davidson while out on the road. He's a motorcycle lover and has a deep passion for bikes. He can often be seen cruising around on his black Harley Davidson 48. The bike, which cost at minimum $11,299. In 2019, his pal Joshua Schultz shared a video of the 192 alum taking his bike out to the desert for a joyride. His motorcycle cost him at least $11,299, and apparently he takes care of it like a baby. Some of his Instagram pictures are filled with his bike and the handsome actor himself. And don't forget Rusty James, remember? Take a look for yourselves. For a guy who loves his ride, and his pet, Tyler Hines is just getting more desirable with every moment, and a lot of it has to do with how brilliant of an actor he is. But did you know that Hines also found immense success behind the camera as well? The actor who acted in the movie Roadhouse Romance is also a skilled editor, producer, and writer and director as well. He's found success behind the camera. The Roadhouse Romance actor is a writer, editor, producer, and director. Tyler has expanded into directing, writing, and producing a fan of filmmaking. His very first time producing and directing a short film in 2010 named Doug. Two years later, he wrote, directed, and produced a short film named Firefly. Hines has also worked in several music videos too, including Sean Frank and Oliver Heldens' video for Fifty Shades of Grey in 2015. Further on, the actor once again joined forces with Sean Frank to direct, produce, and edit Delaney Jane's throwback video. With so much happening, it is quite obvious that Tyler Hines is a busy man and always on the run, but guess what? He truly enjoys it. In other words, Tyler Hines is a world traveler. While he isn't working, he spends most of his time jetting off to exotic locations, including Greece, Brazil, New York City, and the beaches of California. Travel is something that Tyler loves as well. When he isn't working, he likes to take off and explore the world. He has been to very exotic locations such as Greece, Brazil, New York City, and California. He loves the water and the beach. Hines once revealed that one of his friends was building a cottage and that would be his escape and he would no longer have to look for another place to stay. Do you know where this cottage is? Do let us know in the comments below if you do. We've already seen that Hines is an amazing friend, but his co-stars adore him too. There came a point when Erin Krakow knew she wanted to work with Tyler Hines, a charismatic fan favorite among the Hallmark set. So when it was time to find the perfect leading man for Hallmark Channel's latest romance, it was always you. The when the call, the hard star, had just one person in mind. Trevi Fountain, Coliseum. Well, people really love Tyler and they're excited to see him. I was excited to work, then actually requested him for this movie because I thought he'd be so great in this part, Krakow told E.T., which Hines confirmed. She expressed that to me, which I'm not sure exactly why she did that, he humbly said. I'm very thankful she did because we had a very nice time. Aaron's an incredible human being and a very, very talented actor. So now that we're going over each other's of his secrets, aren't you interested to know a bit about his early life? Here's a sneak peek into the growing years of Tyler Hines. The Canadian actor was born to Tyler Jeffrey Hines and Betty Hines in Ontario and has a brother named Brandon Hines. Tyler Hines, what took place on 6th May 1986 in Toronto, Ontario, Canada. 
He was born Tyler Jeffrey Hines to his mother Betty Robbie Short Hines. He has a sibling, a brother named Brandon Hines. He has maintained his secrecy when it comes to relationships. He attended St. Francis Xavier Catholic High School as well as North Dundas High School. And you'd be amazed to know that his school days he spent most of his time skateboarding. Although Hines is known to be a creative person, he prefers to keep his personal life private. Despite that, we did manage to figure out his net worth. Wondering how much? Tyler Hines is easily sitting on seven hundred thousand dollars. And he makes this through his work as a filmmaker, which includes directing, producing, and editing. It's pretty clear by now that Tyler Hines is a busy man, and we're pretty sure you are too. But taking a few seconds to give us a like, share this video, isn't too much to ask, right? Meanwhile, please don't forget to subscribe to our channel because we got a lot more content coming your way. So just like you did a noble thing by smashing that like button, Hines has invested his time and money into several charitable organizations. One of his fans went one step ahead to show his love for the Hallmark star. This fan we're talking about surprised Heinz on his birthday by donating funds to create a drama award in his honor and the proceeds would be forwarded to help those children who want to join the drama camp. Tyler Heinz is everyone's favorite actor. He is loved by his fans. Recently, his fans surprised him on his birthday by donating the funds to create a drama award in his honor. Some reports also say that Heinz himself attends these camps and fans can't help themselves from being super thrilled. With that said, do you know any other secrets about Tyler Heinz? And which ones were your favorite from today's video? Please comment down below. Thank you so much for watching. Until next time.